Scientists using NASA's James Webb Space Telescope have made an exciting discovery on K218b, a distant planet 124 light years away in the constellation Leo. They've detected gases like dimethyl sulfide, DMS, which on Earth are only produced by living organisms. This discovery raises the thrilling possibility that K218b could be home to some form of life. In this video, we'll explore what this could mean, delve into the science behind these findings, and discuss why this distant world is now a key focus in the search for extraterrestrial life. Join us as we unravel the secrets of K218b and consider the profound question, are we alone in the universe? K218b has captivated astronomers and exobiologists alike, not just for its placement in the habitable zone, but for its intriguing atmospheric composition, which may suggest the presence of life. Located 124 light years away, this exoplanet orbits its red dwarf star K218 and has become a focal point in the search for extraterrestrial life due to its Earth-like qualities and the presence of water vapor as previously identified by the Hubble Space Telescope. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unparalleled observational capabilities, has recently brought us one step closer to understanding this distant world. Its sensitive instruments have detected signs of dimethyl sulfide or DMS, methane, and carbon dioxide in the planet's atmosphere. DMS on Earth is a biomarker produced primarily by marine phytoplankton, and its detection on another planet is a tantalizing hint that life could exist there. Methane and carbon dioxide are also critical to this puzzle. On Earth, these gases are associated with biological activities and geological processes, such as volcanic activity, which are essential to sustaining an ecosystem. The technique used by astronomers to detect life on this planet is spectroscopy, which involves analyzing the light from the star as it passes through the planet's atmosphere. The chemicals in the atmosphere absorb light in different ways, creating a unique fingerprint that tells us about the composition of the atmosphere. As mentioned, the atmosphere of this planet is intriguing. This is because it lies in the habitable zone of its star, where temperatures could allow for liquid water, a key ingredient for life as we know it, to exist on the planet's surface. However, the presence of liquid water depends on several factors, including atmospheric pressure, temperature, and chemical composition, which astronomers are still trying to understand. This exploration also raises questions about the types of life forms that could exist in environments different from Earth. If life exists on this planet, it could be radically different from the life forms we are familiar with. More on that in section three. K218b orbits a red dwarf star placing its habitable zone much closer to the star compared to our solar system. Red dwarfs are known for their turbulent behavior and frequent flares, which emit high levels of solar radiation. Such radiation can be challenging for potential life forms. However, K218b's substantial atmosphere might shield it from these harsh conditions. Additionally, the planet's ability to retain water vapor is critical, as it suggests the potential for stable liquid water reservoirs providing a stable environment where life could thrive. Furthermore, the presence of detected greenhouse gases in its atmosphere is vital, as they could contribute to a greenhouse effect, helping to sustain a habitable climate. The presence of DMS adds another layer of intrigue. On Earth, DMS is involved in cloud formation and climate regulation, as it is converted into sulfate aerosols that act as cloud condensation nuclei. If similar processes occur on K218b, this could further stabilize the planet's climate, making it more conducive to life. These aerosols could reflect some of the star's radiation, helping to cool the planet effectively. However, the potential habitability of this planet is complicated by its size and composition. Being significantly larger than Earth, this planet is classified as a mini-Neptune, with a thick atmosphere that could exert high surface pressure, an environment quite different from Earth's surface conditions. This raises questions about the type of life that might exist there. Could life adapt to such high pressures? What kind of biochemical processes would be possible in such an environment? Astronomers are also curious about the thermal properties of this planet. Its temperature profile will significantly affect its habitability. 
If the greenhouse gases lead to runaway heating, as seen on Venus, the surface conditions could be too harsh for life as we know it. Conversely, if the planet can maintain a stable temperature range, the chances of finding liquid water, and potentially life, greatly increase. Whether microbial or intelligent, human-like organisms in K218b, the potential discovery of life would mark a transformative moment in scientific history, offering insights into life's universality, potentially leading to medical and industrial breakthroughs, and fundamentally altering our understanding of biology and our place in the cosmos. This would also spark ethical discussions on protecting these alien ecosystems, shaping future policies for responsible space exploration. We could potentially communicate, share knowledge, think advanced tech, and gain new perspectives on the universe. This would require combining multiple fields like linguistics and engineering to bridge the communication gap. The detection of life on this planet would necessitate a long-term commitment to monitoring and research. This would ensure the protection of Earth's biosphere while fostering a responsible approach to exploring the planet. Scientifically, such a discovery would guarantee that exoplanetary research remains a central focus, possibly culminating in efforts to send messages or even probes to this planet, despite the vast distances and technological challenges involved. The discovery would likely lead to a significant increase in funding and resources for space research and exoplanet exploration, sparking a new era of technological advancements in robotics, nanotechnology, and artificial intelligence. On a broader scale, knowing we are not alone would profoundly influence global culture and philosophy, potentially unifying humanity under a shared cosmic identity or causing divisions based on differing beliefs about how to interact with alien species. Moreover, the surge in public and academic interest in science and astronomy would enrich educational curricula and enhance global scientific literacy, nurturing a new generation of explorers dedicated to unraveling the mysteries of the cosmos. In summary, the discovery of signals indicating life on K218b would be a watershed moment in human history, reshaping our scientific endeavors and philosophical outlooks. This moment would not only redefine our understanding of life, but also extend our reach and aspirations within the vast expanse of the universe, forever altering our collective future. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the clouds of K218b. Each piece of data we gather brings us one step closer to understanding whether we are alone in this vast cosmos. See you next time.